the hell is that? Subsidence? From the aftershocks? This looks like archaeological gear. Somebody was studying this ruin. Hey, we could use those lamps. The light could guide the Marines to us. Do you think that still works? <laughs> It'll work. Just needs gas. We need to find some. Wherever you are, Nick, I hope you're safe. Sorry? Did you say something? No, nothing. You've got to see this. Eric, check this out. Why would there be a machine gun here? It's a World War II model. Ties in with the time the archaeologists were here. What the fuck happened here? I hope we can get this thing started. Do you think Stencom is aware of our situation? I'm hoping the pilots got word back. If any of them survive, that is. We need to get these shit. lights running ASAP. I can't see shit. From a point of defense, this place has some good choke points, but overall, it's a weak setup. Could have been done under pressure. I don't know the constraints they were working under. This temple, it was built to appease the gods. What do you think the rest of the squad are doing? They're tough, each and every one of them. The muscle through. Fuck, that's a hell of a lot of fireworks. All call signs, this is King. Does anyone copy over? with these cans. Oh, tell me I had a little luck. <sighs> How's the leg holding up? Leg? Oh, you mean the prosthesis. I lost my leg back on the highway. Don't. I still feel guilty. I didn't make it easy on your rage. I know that. You weren't to blame for that crash. Mom, let's get to work. Damn, you trying to apologize. Come on now. Oh, fuck! I didn't see what the fuck that was. I was looking down at my feet. Something moved. I got scared. Shine a light on the tank. Ah, oh, shit. What's 
wrong? Fuel tube's worn loose. The damn valve is leaking. Can it be fixed? We have to secure the tube before starting the generator. There's gotta be something here to fix it. Maybe climbing out of the cavern back there would have been the smarter move. Yeah, the way I see it, if these people were here before us, there must be another way out. September the 24th, 1945. When Lady Bradshaw summons you, you go. Mary and I were bound for our honeymoon, but the chance to dine with one of Britain's finest antiquarians was too great for us to miss. When we met, Bradshaw wore a brooch that caught Mary's eye. A Sumerian relic recovered from a dig site in the Hashemite Kingdom of Iraq. After dinner, she showed us another find from the same site, a gold cuneiform tablet. She called it the final puzzle piece in her life's work, a map that pinpoints the tomb of Alexander the Great. If she's right, the tomb lies somewhere on the border of Iraq. Lady Bradshaw wants us to lead her expedition. I realize now that our honeymoon will take place in a dusty dig site in the Sagros Mountains. All right, Randolph. This place is starting to make me feel a little uneasy. Yeah, me too. I'm beginning to think that even the Iraqis don't know about this place. What happened to these guys? Oh, 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 oh. Are you fucking duct tape in here? Any fucking duct tape? So I don't see any duct tape. Uh, excuse me. That's a scope. That's a paper. Oh, duct tape. Something's bad about to happen here in a second, Mo. It's way too fucking quiet. I found some duct tape. See if we can jumpstart this generator. The fucking monster right around behind me somewhere. He already looked over there. Where's the fucking generator at there, Doc? Bro, you fucking punk! What's that generator How at? Could something this vast have remained hidden for so long? Hey, uh, I looked over there. Is that generator at? Where's my? Is that machine gun? You got it? I've got it. Is this a good time to talk? That depends. What's on your mind? Back at the base, you said we'd talk when the time is right. It looks like we've got the whole place to ourselves. This gonna has got to be the worst date ever. Why'd you pick this dump? Yeah, I don't know what happened. The reviews were good. We're gonna make these Wait, two love each sec. other. I think I fixed the leak. There's gotta be Ashley and Chris, Hold the Chris all over again. It's done. Duct tape fixes everything. Hey, give me a hand with this panel. <clears throat> Look at the state of these. They're shot.
feels like so long since we worked on something together. Same time feels like yesterday. Rachel, we both allowed each other space and this break. I mean, look what it's done for our careers. You, a field officer for the CIA, and I mean, Kayla's could change the face of the entire war. If Deborah decides to work, sure. I don't think either of us expected to be out of each other's lives for so long. Past year or so, my head's been buried in Kalis, and I was blind to anything else. Your work is bigger than the both of us. Like, I don't think either of us could have foreseen the impact it would have. Rach. Say what's on your mind. I've missed you, Rach, like you wouldn't believe. Back then, I don't know, things seem confused, but now... Can somebody fucking die? Or something? I like love Maybe stories and all, but come on! That should do the trick. Let's fire her up. Talking can do the trick. <laughs> There's a way in for these people. There's a way out for us. Let's take a look around. ripped up like i'm sorry dude but if i'm fighting fucking ancient beings but you're like my wife or my best friend you're fucking dying <laughs> like, i'm sorry let's go Locals were spooked by these.
here. Take a look at this. You think it still works? Let's find out, shall we? The tape is all tangled up. It's fine, I can fix that. Looks like that ring still means something to you. I don't see you wearing yours. Always close to my heart. You're always a good guy. Maybe too good for me. I haven't forgotten what this ring means to me. I want you back, Rachel. We were pretty damn good together. Fuck you, Nick. No offense to you, Nick, but you're a bitch, Nick. I knew it. What do you want from me, Eric? The truth can be a good start. What does that mean? Wait, what? Know you better than you think, Rachel. You lied to me about that lighter, and it wasn't about a secret smoking habit. Eric, Tell please. me the truth. Don't do this. Admit it. There's someone else, isn't there? The bones of this temple are drenched in blood. We have set foot on an uncharted shore and roused something ancient and wicked. A blasphemy that comes in indescribable shapes and forms. For eons we lived as children in this world, unaware of the horrors that slumber beneath our feet. Now we have blindly thrown open the gates to madness. I fear being taken. But I must do what I must. We must seal this place for eternity. For all mankind. Mary, I'm sorry. not supposed to play out like this. Any call signs? This is King. Contact, contact. Taking fire. Just get the coffee. Over. That's Rachel. King, this is Mailman 2 on action. Say again. Over. King, this is Mailman 2 on actual. How copy? Over.
Nothing simple this goddamn place. You're not serious. That looks decades old. That's all we have. Can you see him? Yeah, he's coming. Whatever happens. So we might have to let Rachel go. If something falls down and we have to either choose Rachel or, or so we might have to let Rachel go. I feel like <laughs> right here. Rachel! I got you, Rach. I got you. Let her go. If I didn't let go, he was gonna come kill me. No. No. N no, no, no. Because I watched the cutscene. If I didn't do that, Dar was gonna shoot Eric, kill or shoot at Eric, make Eric slip, get stabbed in the head by the rocket, and Rachel would have fell down anyways. I did it myself. I saved both of our lives, right now. I hope. Who's this nerd? Fuck out of here. What nightmare have these luckless souls fallen into? Oh no. Poor Rachel has been lost to the darkness. No she has not, you lying sack of shit. Bonds that were once thought unbreakable have now been cut free. The like heart is always the first to fall. What of Jason and Nick? Brothers in arms, but are they really as close as they appear? Or will it be a case of each man for himself? Let's not forget that they've already left one man behind to die tonight. Well, you know, they had to save their life, you punk. Which brings us to Salim. He seems level-headed, an almost reluctant soldier, perhaps. An unwelcome fate now awaits our survivors, trapped beneath the earth, swallowed by the void. By the one by one, their lights will be snuffed out, unless you can find the means to save them. It's not my place to concern myself with the affairs of others, but it 
does keep things interesting. I can offer you some words of advice, as long as you are willing to keep this strictly between ourselves. Saying nothing, fuck you. Very well. At least you'll have no one but yourself to blame if things don't pan out quite as fuck you intend. Fuck out of here, you punk. Rachel's not dead. That's all for now. I watched a cutscene. I got the rocky thing. Cunt. know about what he wanted. It's done, Sergeant. Right, right. Just more blood on our head. Colonel, is that you? What happened to Rachel? We, we were ambushed by the enemy. They opened fire on us. And Rich. She fell. I, I held on. <laughs> as hard as I could, I swear. She was taking me down with her. I had to. I had to cut the rope. Rachel! We gotta move. Colonel, we're sitting ducks. We need to fall back now. Over there. Let's go. Oh. Look at that. Over here. Right now, Colonel, the Iraqis are the least of our problems. They're not following. This is Mailman 21 Actual to all call signs. How copy? Over. Joey, report in. Over. Joey's dead. The fuck you talking about? The Iraqis tore right through him. He died in my fucking arms. Oh, no, not Joy. The hell are we gonna get out of this? We gotta lock this place down. Form a defense perimeter and buy ourselves some goddamn breathing space. Lieutenant, what did you mean when you said the Iraqis are the least of our worries? Alright, well, we're gonna just gonna do this in the next video. So.